everyone and welcome. Welcome to the Stocks Will Show Live. This is the Stocks Will Show Play of the Day. It's actually the market. Uh, it's actually a long, <laughs> long market today. That was the best gap to do today. And so this is what I did. And I'm actually still in it. I'm actually still in the whole thing. And actually, there's no reason to take any out here. And then the market's going to make a lift into a newer high here, right in here at this moment here, 12 o'clock major reversal time. So let's go over it. <clears throat> Beautiful call here I made in this market today, and also pretty much this whole entire look of the market this year. I've done so many videos. If you go back and go through them, you can see how I continually have been calling this market extremely well. And today, the market has the potential to get to a very significant target. With 30 cents stop in this today, the market could get up and run up $2, $3. Dream target in the spy today is 200 Realistic target is 199 uh, around 197.60-ish or 198-ish uh, market could hit and, and, and could be done for the day, but it's so early here. Four more hours left in the day and nothing, nothing stopping this market. <clears throat> I actually don't see it playing out that way. I see the market going to the target today, and I guess that's why I'm still in the whole trade. So let's take a look at it here. So again, I like to do quality. I like to do gaps. I always do gaps. It's the only strategy that I trade. However, there's occasionally uh, a day where I don't get a bearish gap because I like to do the bearish ones. And every once in a while, you'll get a gap that, uh, or a day where you don't have any good quality gaps or rate per the 26-point golden gap rating system to the downside. And so then I will look at some longs. I'm not saying I do them all the time, but I'm very, very picky about it. And the one thing I'll be very specific about is that Having an exact focus on a strategy that you trade, even in one direction, really will help you make money in the market consistently. Be consistent in your picks and the things that you do. Be more disciplined. Have less commissions, which you're just paying out to brokers then, so your costs will be less. And you'll make more money overall because you'll be more focused. You'll get good at one thing. And if you can get good at one thing in one direction, then you can do other things um, and also in other directions. Because I've gotten so good at reading the bearish charts and gaps, I'm, I... I've now gotten really good at reading longs. I mean, I've been calling longs to the market actually all year. I've been calling long uh, bullish gaps in the room. When I see the fantastic ones, I call them. But I focused on bearish on the downside for years, okay? And uh, today was just one of these days where, you know, there was nothing to do. I mean, this is the only thing I had conviction in today. I had 100% conviction in the market today to go long, and I did it. So aggressive entry was in here. Stop was at the right place. The market came on down, broke the low. Did it mean the market was going to fall in today? No, absolutely. No chance of failure today in the market to be bullish. I mean, no chance of failure in the market today to be bullish. And so anyways, you could have gone long the market in here. And I was long the market. I've been long the market since the morning, since right out of the gate. And I haven't gotten out of any of this, and there really is no reason to. Although you could have gotten out of a little teeny, weeny, weeny, weeny bit up in here, but we're going to get over 40. Here we're going to get a nicely over 40 here into lunch. So good move in this market today. You could be in the SPY long. You could be in the Qs long. The target in the SPY is bigger than the target in the Qs. I guess that's why I decided to do the SPY today. And I thought there's a possibility you may need new en two entries in this today. You didn't. One entry, one clean entry. And when I saw it was going to set up with the one clean entry, I decided to do it. If you're very, uh, if you're looking at things and you are uh, really wanting to be a, a, an expert trader, I mean, if you want to make money, if you want to do this for a living, if you want to do this for something where you should take seriously, then you absolutely have to have the right focus. And every day when I get up, I'm looking for quality gaps. I'm looking for quality gaps array for my 26-point golden gap rating system. And by golly, I find them. And today was just one of these days where... I talked about it and I said I wouldn't short anything today. I said I wouldn't short anything today. I don't see any good shorts. I don't think any short is going to work today at all. And that was pretty much right on point. And look at the market. Here it is. Over 197.40. Market market could run into close. This is really an all-day trade if you want to hold it. So the market will make a new high. The market here, here we go. Beautiful. I'm not out of any of this yet. Oh, this is so tempting to hold this thing all day. Wow. And some days when you hold things to the big dream targets, I tell you, it really, really pays off. What a nice way to start the week on a Monday in August in the summer. What? I, I am thrilled. Woo. Nice, nice, nice. Got to take advantage of these days when you get them. 
So anyways, what was I saying? The next Golden Gap class is this weekend, August 23rd and 24th. This is the last class for a while. It's going to be Labor Day holiday and uh, going to be time to just chill out until the next earning season. So this will this will be the last class actually before fourth quarter earning season this this weekend, August 23rd and 24th. Uh, so for people that want to want to trade in fourth quarter and want to do it, uh, it's um, it's, it's time to do the class. I'm gonna give myself a little rest break uh, after this class this weekend, which I duly deserve. So, anyways, if anyone's interested in the class, email me at melissa at thestockswish.com. Follow the spy. It's going to get over the high at some point soon. Looking like sooner rather than later. Could be today, could be tomorrow, could be this week. You never know. I've been talking all the time about never short this market at all in here, and yet people have. And I continue to call the market that's going to get out and make a new high. Q's made a new high today. Spy did not, but it's going to sometime soon. Beautiful bullish trade here. Beautiful gap in the market. This is a golden gap to the upside today in the Spy, which I did. This is a stock swish show play in the day. I've called this market very accurately. How? Because I'm reading the price well. How do I read price well? Because I know how to read gaps well. Not every gap that happens in the market, up or down, is significant. You need to know which ones are meaningful, which ones count. The pushback that the market had on Friday was a news-generated thing that just made the market drop down quickly, and then it rallied. Rallied strong into the close when the close on Friday and gapped up this morning. And just a nice look to this whole chart in here. So if you're in core longs, hold on through. I've said it before. I'm going to say it again in probably every video I do. Um, the market's going to make some jimongous green, huge, massive bar someday in here soon. Could be today, could be sometime in the next week. Uh, the market's going to go to a crazy target between now and the end of the year that no one is going to expect. The SPY could get up to 250 before the end of the calendar year. That's a huge number. 200 is 100% in sight. 200 is in sight, okay? And 100 in the queue is in sight. And the SPY could get up to 250 this year. That would be almost a $100 rally from the, from the uh, start of the year. <clears throat> So there it is, people. Market is not extended. Market is not extended. And it's not going to do a correction. It does not have to do a correction. And nothing has to do a correction. The market does not have to do anything but just trade and go. And the market's getting bought on a August Monday. Beautiful show of strength here in this market. So if you'd like to learn more about gaps or reading price and trading and making money as a day trader, email me at melissa at thestockswish.com. Again, the class to do, the Golden Gap class is this weekend that teaches you how to find the stocks to trade, how the rating system, how to take the entries, targets. You learn all of that, how to day trade in the two-day Golden Gap class is this weekend. And, uh, and so if you're interested in doing it, it's going to be the last class before the start of fourth quarter earnings season. Email me at melissa at thestockswish.com. Thanks, everybody. Have a great day.